Hi everybody, this is Tutu Readings and this reading is going to be for Capricorn. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Let's see what are the messages that pop out for you from now till the end of the month, okay? This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. What are the messages for Capricorn? Let's see. Oh, what's happening, Capricorn? I think that you are breaking free. You're enjoying something. Um, maybe there was... I feel like some of you are looking forward to a new beginning. With this Fool card. Taking a leap of faith. Feeling very uh, fearless. Now that we are in Leo season, you could be feeling the urge to do things, to make things happen, no matter what the consequences will be. But I think Capricorn will be still a Capricorn. And you stay grounded, okay? You will stay grounded. At the bottom, you get the Two of Swords, the Knight of Swords. So maybe you, f you, you found out that there was somebody who was cheating on you. And because of that, they just left you out in the cold or just stopped communicating with you. Because they had a third party Capricorn. Okay. Right now, it looks like... You are trying to... Um, I feel like you are very much in your head about something Capricorn, okay? Um... And you have turned a blind eye to things that no longer serve you. So you're cutting something out, okay? You are... <clears throat> There's somebody that you're completely cutting out of your life. You're not even acknowledging something. Okay? Let's get your energy. Where are the messages for Capricorn? Seven of Wands. See? You're very protective of your peace, your mind, your soul, your body, whatever it is. And you want somebody to be honest with you. So I feel like things are becoming clear for you. A lot of air sign energies here. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. So Capricorn thinks that unless this person comes towards me with some truth, I don't want it. This person can keep it. So you're trying to break free from something here. And I feel like you're very determined. You're standing your ground to fight for clarity, to fight for the truth. Okay. Okay. You've been in love or somebody's been in love with you. Let's clarify the lovers. Why is the lovers here? Let's see. King of Cups. Okay, followed by another lovey-dovey card. There's... Okay, some of you maybe are married to this person. I feel like maybe for some of you, I'm getting this storyline that you were married to this person or about to get married or in a stable relationship and then you found out that they were lying or hiding things from you and now you're on your way finding the truth or you want this person to speak the truth. At least, don't leave you hanging, tell you the truth. And Capricorn, you have figured, you, you, you're telling yourself that even if this person doesn't tell me the truth, I need to move on from some nonsense. So there's still a lot of love on both of y'all's part, actually. There's so many deep connecting energy here. Let's get your person's energy. Tell me more about the person Capricorn is dealing with. Tell me more about the person. Capricorn, you're in your head. Your person's in their head. What is this? Ten of Pentacles. This person could be a good businessman or woman. 
yeah i feel like your person wants to be in a relationship with you or you you guys were in a relationship but things just took a turn right now they're very much in their head about you what is this person thinking about capricorn let's see hangman so they think that you are not making a move towards them you might be break, breaking free so they're they're sitting there assuming things about you either you're moving on from them either you're not moving on from them you might be breaking free from the situation you might be letting go so they're sitting there trying to figure it out two of pentacles in the reverse yeah your person's very confused okay or was confused and now they want to come out of conflict uh, this to me looks like your person wants to come out of conflict with you, Capricorn, okay? But they're taking their sweet time to do so. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, look at that Knight of Pentacles. They're taking their time. But eventually this offer will come. And they'll be like, hey Capricorn, let's work things out. I hurt you, I know, but I want to come out of this conflict. There's love. There is love. Capricorn. Oopsie, something fell on the floor. What did? Let me see. The sun in the reverse. Or maybe it was upright. I don't know. I saw it in the reverse. So we're going to take it in the reverse. Uh, Capricorn, your person's not feeling the most happiest, okay? They're coming from a mental space where being without you is getting to them now, okay? Now, it's been a while. You are trying to figure out your own way out of things. You're doing something with your life, with your money, finances, goals, something, okay? But your person's not coming from that space. They're coming from a place of fear. Like, I fear that Capricorn is going to go away from me. And Capricorn makes me so happy. Okay. They're feeling, they're losing hope that you will ever take it back, take them back. But what your story is that you will if they speak the truth and not, you know, give you false hope or they apologize you want them to apologize maybe justice high priestess you're very silent capricorn is very very silent nine of swords capricorn what's troubling you maybe being without this person is also troubling you temperance i feel like um capricorn yeah somebody here is feeling extremely left out somebody um maybe with whom you had a love affair with i feel like capricorn you are moving towards your healing you're trying to heal your heart from something and you're very silent about it. The signs that are here are Gemini, Scorpio, Libra, Pisces, uh, Aquarius, Leo, Aries, Gemini, Sagittarius. Okay. So you're trying to take a step back because you don't want to be in this Nine of Swords energy. That is you currently. Something is troubling you and weighing down your heart. Yeah. You want to be, you want to feel good again. You want to feel balanced again. And feeling like this is not really Capricorn. Capricorn people are very like, I love Capricorns actually. Um, I have Capricorn in my chart too. But one thing I love about Capricorns is that they have the ability to see through bullshit and come out of it as well they love but they they don't really you know sit there 
being blindsided. You know what I mean? So Capricorn doesn't want to stay in this position any longer. You are trying to heal yourself from a toxic environment or from something that you went through. You want to feel independent, confident. You want to feel that you, you're grounded. You want to feel good again. And for some of you, you are really manifesting material abundance. And that is coming to you. I do see you getting that. But I also see that there's a situation that's really, really slow in your life. But you get to a point where you'll be like, forget it. At least I have other things that I need to focus on. So Capricorn is hoping to be this independent, confident person sitting in the middle of their coins, enjoying themselves. Some of you want to travel. Some of you want to, you just want to feel secure in yourself again. You don't want to stay in that nine of swords position longer. So that's why you were breaking free from something in the beginning of the reading. I like it. What's going to be the outcome between Capricorn and this person? Queen of Swords, Capricorn is cutting you out. Or deciding to cut you out because you you mess with their head Capricorn you're very determined to cut them out because you feel like they mess with you every time you give them a chance they mess it up so uh, one thing I'm also getting is that somebody's gonna keep putting this exterior to them that's very harsh and cold but deep inside they're feeling vulnerable so it is a defense mechanism here what to expect from now till the end of the month for Capricorn? Page of Wands. You tell me, what does it seem like? Actually, this to me seem, seems like communication. Because how long can you pretend to be this Queen of Swords when deep inside you're feeling low and sad without Capricorn? You At some point, you will reach out. Okay. So let's see. What is the advice for Capricorn? Don't feel sad or things that have already happened. Come out of that energy if you can. Come out of that grief if you can. Because the universe is by your side with the Wheel of Fortune. Let me tell you that. Whatever is making you sad is not going to make you sad any longer. So this is a confirmation that bad times are ending and good ones are beginning in your life. Okay? In your money, in your anything. You know? Yes, the world at the bottom. So if you're somebody who has been waiting and waiting and waiting for a business opportunity, a job, anything that is troubling you, you finally have light at the end of the tunnel and you see it let's get you some romance angel oracles tell me messages for capricorn and their person okay two cards are here already free yourself it is time to take back control of your life wow isn't that your energy capricorn i was getting it mm -hmm. attraction you attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully okay there's still a lot of attraction but you're still working on yourself you're taking control back you want to feel good again you, you don't want to feel bound and tied to you know tied and bound to a situation that makes you feel sad give me more energy for capricorn and their person You deserve love. You are lovable. So this person's finding you very lovable, very attractive. Honeymoon. Yeah, some of you are wanting to travel somewhere to free your mind, to feel good again. Or just trying to take some free time for yourself. Chemistry, there's a strong magnetic attraction here. No wonder the lovers, the chemistry, king of cups. You two are still in love. It's going to take some time to come out of it if you are. 
what is going to be the outcome actually in love here between these two expressing your love letting go of control issues capricorn has already given up on controlling this situation but i feel like somebody's going to be expressing something to you okay so that's about it capricorn those were the messages that popped out for you give this video a like and subscribe to my channel um yeah take care and bye, -bye.